Welcome back, gaming lounges. Zacharoni here at Living That Gaming, and today we're going to continue with Sly Raccoon. So the time of the ticking, and we're back on this level. Wait, what was it again? Oh, a grave undertaken. To look for the remaining clue balls. And I found this one, it was right here, where basically this entrance was right there. And now I can, now since I have Mr. Gator's blueprints, I can scan where the next one is. What do you know? It's just down there. Just need to remember where that is, really. So, guess we can get Mika away there. Careful. Oh boy. Oh boy, whoa. Yeah, I remember, I forgot about those. Whoop, whoop. I don't want to get mosquitoes by those mosquitoes. Giant mosquitoes. Anyway, where was it? Oh, it was just hiding underneath there. Convenient. Now all we gotta do is just find the safe. Oh, whoop. Make our way through here. Got ya. And there's one more ghouls and goblins to take care of. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go ouch. <laughs> Katana had a lucky horseshoe there. Anyway, there's the safe. So let's What do you know? I got another lucky horseshoe. Okay, Bentley, do your magic. Okay. Guess, but try one, two, eight. Are you sure it's a guess? It almost seemed like you actually knew. Uh, Bentley, you're still talking. <laughs> what do you say, Bentley? Uh, your mouth's a move. Your mouth is move moving, but I can't hear what you're saying. <laughs> anyway, we've done it for you. Mind bending. Here's huh? Perpetual slow motion technique. Oh. With this move, you can slow down time whenever you want. Not just while jumping. Huh. Hold down the triangle button to use it. Comes in handy. So that means I can just hold it down and make motion. Sorry, couldn't resist. Anyway, we're back out here, and now two more levels have revealed, but first we gotta find them. And I think I know which way we need to go next. Gotcha. I think this play might have. I think we need to go through this again. So that means stay in the shadow, away from those guards. We've already been through that way, so let's try this way. Oh, we get to go on a scooter ride. What the? I didn't press the fire button. them to fight against these ghosts while on this cruise. Who knows when they'll pop where will where they'll pop up. Right there. Oh whoa whoa stay back stay back stay back, stay back. oh boy flying skulls Phew took him out he might be a bit of a hazard deal with. Best part about this level, you don't need to look for clues anymore, so it looks like we found all the safes what we... Ouch. Well, we've done this area. And look 
Okay, we found a checkpoint. Obviously, if I keep blowing stuff up, I get money. Who doesn't love a job where you get paid for blowing stuff up? up? Unless you're a demolition expert. That's okay. Oh, the money! The money! The money! The money! The money! The money! Well, obviously no monies are in candles. I get the, I get the wax on really that expensive here. Oh boy. Well, there's some goats behind there, but the only problem is that barrier is blocking it. So it looks like we're gonna have to mash our way, well, blast our way through there. What a waste of pennies. Voodoo's private stuff. Oh, I can't hit those. I can't hit those. Oh boy, now we're dealing with ghosts and a fire. Another lucky horseshoe for the collection. Now I'm all golden. I oh, can't go down there. Ah, checkpoint. Oh boy. Great. Not only I have to barrack blast my way for the door, but also I have to watch out for flaming skull heads and also ghosts. That took care of them. Now for the flaming skull head. That took care of them. Let's move on up. Oh boy, two of them now. What part is? Both paths are blocked. So it looks like we're going to go back and forth. And also get those points while I'm at it. That's one down. And another one down. Grab all the loop change before they disappear. Oh boy. Oh, there's the key. All we gotta do is just fight our way to it. Ouch. No fair. Yeah, that, that's done. One down, only two more to go. I care about those points. They're not worth it. That's two down, only one more to go. Oh, darn it! Huzzah! Sorry, just need to put all the books changed. Oops. There goes that loose change. Well, that's done and done. Now we just need to find the last level. Okay. Whoa, 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 careful, 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 careful. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Whew. For a second there, I thought I flipped it. Oh. Oh, we're back where we started. Maybe I need to go up. But the big question is, how do I do that? I mean, come on, I gotta remember what I did last time. 
Obviously, it's not down there. Whoa. Yeah, the frame rate is getting a bit of a... Getting a bit of a beating. Well, chopping. Oh, right. <laughs> Through that way. Home... Down home cooking. Oh, away. I think I remember this level. Yeah, let's destroy those candles. There, that made a shortcut more easy. I think I remember this level. This one's another frustrating level. We need to get all the right amount of chickens. What? That ghost over there contacted me on Spectre Wave Radio, and we've cut a deal. He's promised us a key if you can whack 50 chickens. I guess he needs them to make a big pot of gumbo, but he's scared of the bob toten roosters. Be careful, or they'll blow you to bits. Think you could do it? I think that's what somebody forgot to mention. Well, the re maybe that's the reason why he wanted to wanted those chickens in, in the first place. So yeah, we are whack we gotta whack 50 chickens before time runs out while avoiding the bomb roosters, which is easier said than done. Like those. See, they're just gonna keep following until they explode. Oh boy! Darn it! That didn't give me a chance. This is gonna take a while, but luckily I managed to stock up on lives. Maybe just stay away from the... Come on. Another set of roosters. Coming after me. I just gotta make sure they come, come into contact with each other. Whoop, whoop. Like that. Got it. Whoop. Oh boy. I would try and go fast forward, but unfortunately. Oh boy. How many chickens have we got? Why am I on the time? Why is this kind of game, kind of mission on a time limit though? If I'm just running for my life. And now I'm not gonna make it. Would I? Oh, come on! I just don't expect it. Yeah, this one's definitely another frustrating mission. Because you really need to... You know, try, try and get the right line of chickens while avoiding the bombs. But exploding roosters will have a habit of chasing you down. Oh boy, oh boy. There we go. Oh boy, there they go again. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I'm supposed to be a master thief, not a chicken. Not a chicken rounder. And besides, it's chicken cruelty that is. Although, although come to think of it, we do actually cook them really. Oops! Well, I messed that up. Gee, they didn't want contacting with each other. Yeah. Man, this is gonna be so. I'm not sure how long this is gonna take. 
Hopefully not the entire video. Oh, come on. That was... How did they hit the kitchen? Not... again. Uh-oh. Get away, get away, get away, get away. Come on. Thank you. 25 seconds left. Oh, I think we can do it. Don't let those distract me. Oh, come on. Whew. That was close. Did two more now. One more to go. Got it. Oh, that was close. That was super duper close. Let's just grab that key and get out of here. Oh, no more chicken whacking. There. All done, done. Now we can face Miss Voodoo herself. Oh, Sly, we do the honors. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. So now what? Oh, we jump, we jump on that cauldron. Okay, so I guess we keep playing until we defeat Madam Voodoo. In fact, she has one of the interesting boss fights, interesting fights in the in this game, and you'll find out why. In a deadly dance. Most distastefully bad juju. Yeah, well, you give me the creeps too, lady. Cooking up an army of ghosts isn't a very neighborly pastime. <laughs> oh, sly. I see your mouth a moving, but all I hear is blah, blah, blah. Well, if jaws need to flop, then let them flop. See you in the next world, Slack Koopa. Same to you. Oops, that was a bad start. I forgot. Oh right, yeah, water. <laughs> and also, I can't believe I forgot about the water. Well. You know, the one of the Phoebe's Raccoon pays saying if I jump into water, I'll just jump back out of it. And now we're nearly there and Gotcha. What the oh yeah. Back here. You can't run away forever. Quiet true. Quiet true. Why don't I have my servant Chumley escort you over here? Alright. What's the catch? Oh that much. Just a little game I like to play with all my annoying guests. Here it comes. I want to see how well you pay attention. What do you mean? Well, I'll unleash my mighty mojo magic upon you. If you repeat what I do, you'll dodge it just fine. If not, you'll get set. <laughs> A little voodoo, Simon says, huh? Sounds easy enough. Well, we don't have any horseshoes, but... That's different. Go on. Gotcha. That's phase one. Now into phase two. Oh. Come 
Come on. Beating. Nearly there. With the last raid to go. I think I remember when I was little, I couldn't really do this. Well, more until I got the timing. Now things are getting faster. That's it. Oh, what? I thought I pricked it. I swear I pricked it. Oh, that was so sneak. I pricked the egg button just in the moment. Now I gotta do that scenario all over again. Yeah. Try to see. I'm guessing that temple that really gets you. Yep, that's the first phase. Just turning something off my alarm. That's it. That's it. Second phase. Now on the third one. Come on, we got to do this. So I can wrap this up. Now the tempo's going fast. Locked it then. That's it. Okay. Gotcha. Happen there. Got some rhythm, raccoon. But it won't help you none if you're fixing to go after the panda king. He's tough with a capital T. You go poking around his stronghold in China, you're likely to get poked back. Yeah, 
Yeah, well, if he's anything like the rest of you, I think I'll manage. <laughs> Good point. Ms. Ruby's section of the Thievius Raccoonus held notes from my pioneering ancestor, Slight in Common. His Slight invisibility common. technique allowed him to steal from corrupt pharaohs and greedy noblemen. Hmm. Right on schedule, Inspector Fox's arrival cued my exit. The production of zombies, made illegal in the World Peace Accord of 71, earned Ms. Ruby a life sentence behind bars. <laughs> While the gang and I enjoyed a few weeks in the tropical sunshine, huh. working on our tans in preparation for our next caper. Also, I want to point out, really, that if you want to... Well, you want this... If some players who have played the PS2 version of this and also the PS3 version will probably notice the difference in the Voodoo, Miss Voodoo, because, well, Sansu sort of bushed it in the PS3 version. If you all know what I mean. Travel plans to China have all been worked out. Well, we'll be doing all that next time in this in this episode in in this series so that's the end of this part but join me back later for more sly raccoon here at living like gaming see ya gaming loungers